this was a very atypical performance for your team. What did you make of this one tonight? Yep, we got in a, a big hole early. It was hard to dig out of. So we're, we're a good team when we help each other out. Um, you know, so we have, we'll take a look at the film. What's your message to the guys after a night like this? It just shows you how quickly things can change in the league. You know, played really well at Minnesota next game. You know, we didn't play well. So we have to take a look at it, make our corrections, get ready for the next one. You mentioned giving up 38 in the first quarter there. I know you need to take a look at the film, but what would you put your finger on defensively as being the issue? Probably a compilation of things. I thought we were low energy on offense, low energy on defense, turn the ball over, turn it over, and then gave them fast break buckets, you know, so they went on a run. Durant put a lot of pressure on us. So. Tom, especially in that, in that first quarter when Durant is, he had six assists in the first quarter. How, how do you think you guys did just playing? I know you loaded up on him, but how do you think you guys did playing those black passing lanes? Well, the thing is, he he got everything. He you know he scored. He made he made plays. He created easy offense. So, you know, we have to do better. You know, that's I think giving them they got a lot of confidence in that first quarter. So. Uh, you, you do that, it's hard hard to slow a team down once they get going like that. Tom, when you say low energy offense, low energy defense, is that any you miss shots? Yeah, no, it's, you know, it snowballed on us. So probably over dribbling. And then, you know, like when you have to, because of the switching, you have to cut more, right? So you have to slip, you have to put pressure on the rim. You can't stand, you got to move the ball. You got to move your bodies. So there's no stats for that. That's just giving yourself up for the team. And so when you do that, you know, we're a, a, a good offensive team. You know, we, you know, we didn't make shots, so that, that's part of it. And some of them were, were good looks. Some of them wide open. We didn't, we didn't make them. I think the other night uh, against Atlanta, you were saying defensive transition, you, you didn't love it. Well, it it's more the live ball like stuff. It, it's, and that's, the, that's a big, like, you know, we're not going to be perfect. You're going to turn the ball over some. You know, but you got, you got to make sure you're not conceding those baskets. And so, like, that, that's the thing. Hustle to get back, not to give those points up. You can make a mistake and get the ball back, you know. But we're, we're giving too many points up off turnovers. And that, you know, like, that, that's something that we have to fix. So you saw that again a little bit tonight? Yeah, yeah. When you saw I, mean, I think we had 15 turnovers and gave up 25 points. When you said in the beginning we were a good team when he helped each other, you weren't seeing that tonight. Was that off when you were talking about? Nah, that? you know, and it's it's like you help each other out with a screen, mm -hmm. you help each other out with a slip, you you help each other just kicking the ball side to side, and then move without the ball. Sometimes your cut is what will loosen the defense up, right? And so, and the thing is, is and, and I, I want to make sure that is that I think sometimes when you get in a hole like we did. There's a sense that I want to get us out of this, and you can't do it by yourself. You have to do it with each other. You got to help each other. You know that's, and I think part of it was we were trying to get out of the hole, and then we were, you know, trying to do it too much like by ourselves, and you can't do that. You know, so well, hopefully we'll learn from it, and I and I think we will. Tom, what was the biggest area of con just concern for you, or what was most upsetting about tonight's performance? Just the way, the way we get we got behind it. The thing is, is like readiness to play is a big part of the league. It's like when you look at teams that have the lead after the first quarter. So like you don't want to ease into a game, particularly on the road. You're on the road and you got to come out with intensity and urgency. And look, missed shots are part of the game. We can deal with that. But like that's where we have to be able to count on our defense, our rebounding, and low turnovers. That'll put us in position to win. Some nights we're going to shoot a great. Like we shot a great the other night, we didn't shoot a great tonight. So, but we got to be able to count on those other things. Those other things we can control. And so I think that's that's the big thing. And we can't, you know, you, you can't allow, if you're not making shots, you, you can't allow that to affect other parts of the game for you.
you know, so I think that that's, that's probably the biggest thing. Tom, you've gotten a couple of games now to look at, at Sims with the first unit. What, what do you think of the way that the offense works with him out there? Well, the thing I do like about him is the, the pressure that he puts on the rim. You know, and I think that that, you know, it forces the defense to collapse and that'll open up other things for us. And he gets out of his screens usually pretty quickly, you know, and he plays above the, above the rim. So I like that part of him. Uh, and, you know, the thing is, is he's still, like, finding his way, but he's a very good passer. We haven't seen that yet, but we, we've seen it in practice. You know, so there's a lot of – there's he's got a big upside to him, you know, and we didn't play well as a team tonight, so – but I like him a lot. They just played harder than us tonight, you know. Um, they played harder, they, they played together, so – yeah, that was really that was really the story of the game. The offense, low energy defense. Do you think it's just when you fall behind like that, shoulders get slumped, or? Uh, you know, I think also like in the third, you know, we really did like a, a good job of fighting, you know, at, at that point. But it's, it's tough when when a team starts the game out like that. Do you think that first quarter was more them or more you guys not maybe bringing the needed urgency? Yeah, you know, we we weren't ourselves tonight. Um, of course, at 82 games, a game like this is going to happen, but we can't, we can't make this a habit. You know what I mean? Like, we got to come out with, with energy every single night um, as much as we can. So, uh, it's a good thing that we got another one Friday. Coach was saying that there's a sense, you know, when you guys are behind like this, to kind of individually take over, just because you want to do what you can for your team. I mean, how do you find the balance between doing that and then also making sure that you guys continue to play as a team? I think if we do, we do, and if we do, we did. And Minnesota, you know, just all moving the ball, all, all sharing the ball, and then uh, playing hard on defense, and then getting out in transition, getting some easy ones. You know, that's that's fun basketball, and, and when we get back to that, uh, we'll be good.